Hello, I am Heather Massey, the writer and performer of Hetty, The Life and Inventions of Hetty Lamar, about the actress and inventor Hetty Lamar, which will be showing at the Scranton Fringe Festival September 28th through 30th in 2018. So I had a dream of creating a show like this for years. I found as much writing as I could on Hetty. I read all the books that were out there. I found everything, uh, all the footage that I could that was out there. I watched all of her Hollywood films that I could get my hands on so I could get a really good picture of who she was. It was in 1942 when Hetty and her co-inventor George Antile, who was an avant-garde composer, when they received their patent for the secret communication system for torpedoes. They gave the patent to the US Navy to support the Allied forces during World War II and it was shelved for decades. Hetty was not given credit for this invention until 1997, 55 years later. So part of the reason that I do this show is to set history right to give Hetty credit for what she did, what she created was way ahead of her time. And so that now we can celebrate her secret genius in creating technology that we use every day. I get to say a lot of the really poignant things that she had to say. One of my favorites is, well, there is no secret to glamour. Any girl can be glamorous. All you have to do is to stand still and look stupid. <laughs> so that's one of my favorite phrases of Hetty. It, it, it's very telling about her life. The other actors that come in, literal actors, including Jimmy Stewart, he was, he was one of her favorite co-stars. She worked with him several times uh, in um, Come Live With Me and in Ziegfeld Girl. Oh, well, I'm, I'm very honored that, that, that Hetty has uh, asked me to be a part of her play. <laughs> so I've been uh, taking this show around the world because I have a mission. My mission with the show is to inspire audiences to find ways to make the world a better place. Also to encourage young women in endeavors of science and technology and to establish Hedy Lamar as a role model for intelligence and ingenuity. As, as Hedy was, I was always, I'm always seeking to find a better way to do things and always seeking to do good work. Um, and as Hedy in the show, um, she encourages the audience to, to do the same thing. And she calls on uh, a poem that, she, that was very important to her, that she actually read over the phone to her son Anthony a couple times. So here's just a little bit of that. You give the world the best that you've got, and you may just feel kicked into the teeth. You give the world the best that you've got anyway. 